Okay, so we're coming on to exercise 5.2. Uh, let's see what is the nth term of an AP land. Suppose these are the list of the numbers that we have. And obviously, it's 8,500 minus 8,000 is 500. And 9,000 minus 8,500 is once again 500. And 9,500 minus 9,000 is also 500. So our common difference is 500. And yes, it is an AP. And so this is the first term, second, third, fourth, and the fifth. And now, if we have to find the hundredth term of an AP, so as I was using in the previous questions, I was using this A plus 99 into D. So I was using this. So how we arrived as this, uh, the formula or the situation is, so this is the, let's say this is the N. So if this is N, so this is, one less than this n so uh, this is our first term and this is n minus one into d so that's how we arrived as this formula and we know that we, if we have to find the hundredth term then this has to be uh, the 99 times the common difference that is added to the first term so this is the formula for the nth term and nth term means if we have to find any of the term from the given list of the ap we can use this formula. Suppose we have to find the, in this, if we have to find the hundredth term, so the hundredth term would be A plus 99D, and it's A, so if you put in the value, A is 8,000 plus 99 into 500, so that should give us the hundredth term of this AP. So this is called the nth term of an AP, and if, so we denote it by an so an is called the general term of an ap we also call it the general term because if we put in any uh the number of the term that we want to get this will gives us the general formula for that and if they are let's say total of m terms in an ap so this m term is called the last term and which is sometimes also denoted by l so let's see what type of questions are we going to get on this the nth term or the general term of an AP. So by this time we all know that a n is a plus n minus 1 into d. This is called the nth term or the general term of an AP. So by using this formula we can find out any number of the term we can find any say the nth number of the term in the given ap so let's move on to exercise 5.2 thank you for watching